Hi everyone, in front of me I've got um, a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold uh, 7 and let me show with you how to fix up crashing. So let's begin with the force stop. So let's pretend I've got problems with my camera. Uh, and all we have to do then is to tap on it and hold it and then tap on this info icon in the right upper corner. We will be immediately transferred to this app information um, connected with the camera. And first of all, I highly recommend to simply tap on force stop because usually if the app is opened in the background, even though it is not uh, visible in the recent, it might interfere and uh, you may um, you may meet some problems. So first of all, the force stop. Confirm it with OK. It means that your device will completely turn off the uh, the camera in my case, obviously. Then I highly recommend to go to this usage section and go to storage. Here we've got the section called cache and basically uh, those are junk files which are saved by your, by your device and uh, sometimes and they also might interfere um, w interfere, and you will not be able to use your uh, camera or any other app properly. So just tap on clear cache and your device will immediately remove uh, everything. And after that, I highly recommend to restart your device. You do not need to use a special combination of keys. Just unroll the upper panel to open this control center and tap on this uh, power off icon tap on it and then tap on restart and your device will be automatically restarted and after that um, it should let's say confirm all of the changes you've made and hopefully the app will work perfectly fine if not you can try to uh, update the app especially if it is a third party app so uh, first of all we have to go to the play store make sure that you've got the internet connection because it is required uh, preferably use wi-fi and also make sure that you've got your google account added to the device uh, you can do it right after entering the play store you can sign in or create the account um, but if you're not sure how to do it you can simply check our tutorial of how to add or remove a google account in this specific device so after entering the play store just upon search here tap on this upper panel and enter the name of the app which you'd like to try to update so let me maybe enter the chrome so the um the browser just tap on the results and here we will we will have our uh, google chrome uh, highlighted here uh, here we've got also the options which are connected with it and basically if the update is available you will be able to see this uh, option right here or here it will simply say update and i highly recommend to tap on it your device will download the update apply it and then um, hopefully you will be able to use a newer version without any kind of problems if that doesn't work you can also try to uninstall it so just tap on uninstall tap on uninstall then uh, give your device a time so it will be able to remove everything um, from from the memory and then try to tap on install again uh, because sometimes um, directly installing the newest version will um, will get rid all of the uh, will get rid um, of all of the problems and uh, the last thing which you can try to do is to update your whole device because sometimes older um, system versions might not work with newer uh, versions of the app so to do that again make sure that you've got the internet connection go to the settings and here in this left section uh, we have to scroll down to find this option software update then let's tap on download and install and basically you will be able to meet two different scenarios this is actually a third one uh, because i've got um, my update pending to be downloaded that's why we can see that but basically the first is, uh, the first scenario is where your device is up to date and there's nothing to download so we cannot really download the update and the second one is where your device will actually find the update it will show you the information about it what has been fixed what has been added and then you will be able to tap on download or install somewhere here and then um, download and apply the update all right, so that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.